Well, good morning, YouTube. All right, guys, it is Father's Day, and uh, Katie and I just had breakfast at this little restaurant here called The Eggshell. It's just about a block or so down from the Speedway. We were planning on going for a ride today, and fortunately, all the people that we had talked about riding with had something else come up, and they weren't able to go. So it was just her and I. So I think at this point, we are going to uh, ride up into town, see what's going on up there, go visit Andre and Harry and some other vendor friends that we have. Probably won't be a long ride because, you know, she can't really handle the long rides all that well as of right now. So don't know what we're going to do exactly, but figured we'd take you guys along with us. So we're going to jump on the bike and go. up to the uh the roundabout or the rotary up there near the weirs beach and we're stuck in traffic so good thing i got amazon love jugs in it otherwise we'd be overheating Alright guys, we're just about to the roundabout, but it's taken us a good 20 or 25 minutes to get that last half, three quarters of a mile to get to this point, so it's probably still really, really busy down on the weirs. All right, guys, so we made it down by the drive-in. This is the walkway kind of coming into the drive-in, and this is where Andre and Harry were set up. Unfortunately, their business wasn't as good, but man, even for a Sunday, last Sunday, it's doing pretty good here. If you guys remember last year when we came down here on the Sunday, there was nobody in town. It was like a ghost town through here, but there's a lot of people, a lot of traffic. So hopefully we get you guys some good footage.
Well guys, we're hanging out here for a few minutes because on the way in, I didn't record it, but we found a phone laying in the middle of the road. So I stopped real quick, reached out, picked it up and handed it to Katie. And uh, now that we're up here, we went through it and found the lady's husband and we called him and the two of them were just down by the boardwalk. So we're kind of hanging out here so they can come and collect their phone. Um, I know I'd be really upset if I lost mine and I hope somebody would return it to me instead of stealing it. So just trying to do the right thing. are one of the best bikes ever made old school well old school for a sport bike anyways all right guys katie and i made it up here to the harley dealer we left andre and harry for a little bit but we're gonna be back over there in a little while but i wanted to get a chance to see what's going up here before it was all gone but i'm looking i see the zero rig over there looks like they've already broken down we're here at the turkey farm jp cycle mustang seats already broken down so we're a little bit late to this game but we're gonna walk around the harley dealer see what they've got anyways
Well guys, it's 3 p.m. and they almost didn't want to let us in here because they are closing, but looks like they don't have much in here anyway. So all the bikes are out under the tent. We're gonna walk out there and see. bike like i said pretty much closed down here we looked at some of the bikes over in the for sale tent asked a few questions you guys know i want a new road glide but man they are very very firm on their price and i'm just not going to give them that much money for something just don't think it's worth it I don't know if you guys can hear Katie in the background, but she's over here working the other booth now. We're done and she's over here trying to sell stuff for Andre. All right, guys, I know it wasn't a really long ride today, but thank you for joining us. Uh, you know, we went to the Harley dealer around the weirs a little bit, hung out over here with Andre and Harry for just a little bit. <clears throat> but anyway, it's as good a way as any that I can think of to spend Father's Day. So I hope all of you enjoyed your Father's Day as well. And until the next time we see you. Keep those engines running.